what's up i'm sarah lafay welcome to my channel so this is going to be another week in my hair and life maybe just a few days i'm gonna figure it out i would actually been filming this video for the past few days like i went and got a chemical peel had a photo shoot but i'm looking back at the footage just like man i look a hot mess so i kind of want to restart this little vlog for myself just because i don't I don't want to be looking a hot mess on here for a video that's going to be up forever. And as you guys can see, I took the braids out. I'm very upset about it too. I actually had them in for a little bit longer than what it may have seemed like because when I upload this video, I think it's probably going to be either a week or two weeks apart from my last video. But I've had those braids in for a couple of weeks. Um, but I had a shoot and the client requested that I take out the braids. So the client was paying me more than I even paid for the braids. And then some, I was just like, okay, I'll do it. But when I took out the braids, I right because my hair is not cooperating with me and shorter i know that it is because of stress and also just because of modeling i have to keep reapplying heat i did this whole rant video and i was crying throughout the video um, i'm gonna redo that video though i'm gonna upload that separately to give you guys more of an update on my hair but in this video i just kind of want to do a day-to-day -day how i am styling and maintaining my hair anyway other my sister i'll call her right back anyway um yeah so after work i usually always just come home and just kind of be like bleh but today i wanted to just motivate myself to do something and of course i went shopping hopefully this isn't a distraction end up going shopping and i went back to that place the city girl fashion whatever it's called again that store is I guess the best way I would describe it is the clothes that they sell there are just very, very revealing. And that's not really my taste. However, they do have a lot of cool pieces in there. Um, and they're very body flattering. Anyway, I will show you guys what I picked up. And I'm hoping that every vlog that I do doesn't end up being some type of haul video. Because then that shows me that I, I have a problem. I actually went in there just to get this jumpsuit. Because I had the jumpsuit in a blue denim. And I get so many compliments on it. I was like, what if they have any more colors? And of course they have black. I would have definitely got the black before I got that. No, I would have got the dark denim and the black, so. This is how it looks. And of course this stuff is super overpriced and very poorly made. But again, the style of it is just very unique. So it has two pockets at the bust, two pockets at the hip, and then it's just straight. And then just the center front zipper. So I'm not gonna try this one on, but if you guys click on my model vlog video, I think it's the model vlog video, um, you guys will see how it looks on there. Then I just got some basic black jeans, which I need desperately, especially ones that fit nice. Of course I need them for my own. Anyway, that jumpsuit was 40 bucks, which to me, is a little, mm. And I know businesses have to make money with me working in a business and me owning my own business now i just i don't argue with people about prices like your price is your price because you have a whole lot of other things to consider that you have to pay for on the back end where your product needs to help pay for it plus you need to get paid too so and then i got this jumpsuit not this jumpsuit but sweatsuit whatever you call it but anyway so this I thought was pretty cool because it has the cinching here, here, and at the bottom. It's a little matching jacket. Oh, I didn't realize it has the cinching at the arms. I do want to try this stuff on real quick. Alright, so I have on the jeans now and they fit great. They actually go all the way down to the ankle, which is rare for me. Um, I'm not that tall. I'm 5'8", but... I never can get a skinny jean that comes all the way down. So. All right, so this outfit, I don't know, guys. This is definitely too crop for me. I like to always have my stomach covered, so. Um, but yeah, I don't know. This outfit is like maybe too cool for me or something. But what do you guys think? Right now, I'm stuck with it, but I guess I can always like sell it on eBay or something. And also I had a package from Amazon because I have an Amazon Prime and they gave me 10 bucks. So I bought some earrings and I actually have these in rose gold as well. I always get the earrings from this brand. And then I had a Home Depot gift card courtesy of my sister. So I used it to buy an air fryer. So I got that in the mail today. So I'm going to open this up real quick. So it's by the brand Aria. 
I will figure out how to set up later. I'm not in the mood for this today. Anyway, I'm gonna do some laundry. I'm gonna relax a little bit. And I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this hair later tonight. So I will make sure to get back on here. We'll figure it out together. All right, so I've been sitting here for a minute trying to figure out what to do with this hair. And I've decided I'm gonna try to wrap it. Even though it is a hot, poofy mess, and I'm most likely not gonna wear it down tomorrow. I decided I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap it. <sighs> I'm super duper frustrated with my hair. I'm going to do a completely separate video of me ranting about it. I actually have it in a clip right now. So I'm gonna take this out. And the clip is by Sunder Cash Hair. I always talk about their clip-ins. I really like their clip-ins. Yeah, so my hair has definitely gotten a little shorter. We gonna talk about that in a separate video. I'm actually gonna use the hair fertilizer by ORS. I'm just gonna literally use the tiniest bit because I don't want my hair to like get super oily or anything. I'm just gonna put that on my ends. And that already feels better. And I have a round brush. And someone mentioned that I should do a video about blow drying my hair with a round brush. So let me know if you guys are interested in seeing that because that's something I could definitely do. But I'm gonna take my brush and just brush my hair around. I've never wrapped my hair when it's this frizzed. So I'm interested to see how this is going to look in the morning. I'm just going to take the scarf, pull it nice and tight, but not too tight. And I'm going to take another scarf so that way the back of my hair can be covered. I just folded it in a triangle. bottom half and tuck it up under the first scarf. Night. Good morning. I got the dryer going so I apologize for the noise. Hopefully you can hear me but I'm not going to say too much regardless. One of my scarves came off last night which I just realized when I was doing the makeup. But anyway, let's see what we got. Alright. <laughs> trying to figure out what to do with this. Because I have to meet with my agency today, and initially I was thinking about just doing like a little bun, low bun with two antennas. Um, but I also kind of like the idea of having it half up, half down with the antennas gonna have to go with the low bar today. And I'm gonna put a little bit of the Camille Rose Coco Nip and Honey on the ends of my hair. reconstructorizer as like heat protectant although I want to get the actual heat protectant and then I have my flat iron and my flat iron on the first setting which is 300 I have this flat iron link below I'm obsessed with it love this one but I do want to try a new one for you guys only because I've had this one for so many years and I know you guys probably want to see other options definitely need to go to hold of the L'Oreal steam pot like I can't try that one anyway so I actually ended up just bumping my hair right here to kind of lay it down a little smoother. I'm gonna take the flat iron out at the bottom and just lightly curl it. I kind of want to just maybe curl it. I don't know. Something is not 
right. Okay, so I don't know. We'll see how this goes. I need to run to work. I'm actually gonna run a Starbucks, which is right next door and give me some banana nut bread and I will see you guys later. What's up? So y'all already know what this mask means. I'm looking a mess. Today's actually Thursday. I didn't film yesterday because I did the exact same thing I did on Tuesday. But today I wanted to vlog a little bit. Completely left my camera at home. Uh, today was a super busy day at work. And after work, I went and did my dress fitting for the dress that I'm getting made. Uh, if you guys have seen my last vlog video, this is one of them. I showed you guys some fabric that I had recently got. And uh, the dress fit, it was better than what I was imagining. It's really late, so I'm not in the mood for anything. I like, just wanna brush my teeth, take a shower, and go to bed. I'm gonna wear my hair exactly like this in the morning and have to leave super early in the morning as well. So I'm not gonna film that. Um, yeah, I don't know actually how much I'm gonna film for this weekend other than when I prep my hair for the spa on Saturday. But anyway, I'll check in with you guys later. Morning, so today is Sunday. I missed, I think two days, but um, wore my hair the same style. Past two days, yesterday I was supposed to go to the spa and I did and then they didn't have my appointment scheduled. So, um, I didn't get to prep my hair for the spa like I wanted to show you guys. However, I am going to go to the spa tomorrow and I'll show you guys that. But today's the fourth. I just have my hair in this bun. I went swimming yesterday and my hair got wet a little bit. So, so I have it like that. Um, so it's really wet here and I'm just gonna, because tomorrow I'm gonna get my hair wet again with being at the spa. I'm just going to do it probably tomorrow after the spa. But anyway. That is pretty much it for today. I just slicked the hair back, put a little edge control on there. Look bald, but whatever. And then for my outfit, I have on this jumpsuit that I got years ago from Zara, but the one in Spain. And then just my trash Nikes. Night. I'm actually not gonna even touch my hair because it's pretty matted due to it being wet. So I'm just gonna keep my hair like this and put a scarf, on, put a scarf over it. And then I'm gonna figure out what to do with my hair tomorrow for work before I go to the spa. So anyway, I will see you guys probably tomorrow. Bye. Morning, so today is Monday. I have my hair in this high bun, it's a mess. So that's why I have the camera facing this way. But um, today I'm gonna go to the spa later. So let me get my hair really, really wet. And then I'll be able to do it tonight. I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna do a rod set or if I'm just going to straighten it. But I'll figure it out tonight to see how I'm feeling, but yeah. This is what my hair looks like. All right, what's up? So it's the next day. I got the camera facing this way. I'm looking a mess. I just got home. Ended up washing my hair last night and then just blow drying it and flat ironing it this morning real quick. Uh, nothing really too fancy because it's 91 today. I got this dress in my hand too because I just picked it up. I'm so excited for it. I'll try it on for you guys probably tomorrow or something because I stink and I don't want my dress to smell. And then I have some shoes that'll match it that'll be here tomorrow. But yeah, my hair looks a hot mess right now. And I ended up, I ended up getting just some Pantene repair. Repair and protect shampoo and conditioner. So that's what I wash my hair with. I still have my place like a mess because I was just. <sighs> it's been a long night. Anyway, um, use this to for the protein treatment. Not the protein treatment. It's like a heat protector. And then I use the Mayo. Which one is this? Uh, thermal heat protecting spray. It's like a leave in conditioner. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Tonight, what I think I'm going to do is wrap it <laughs> or put some rods in it. Just like a few so that way in the morning it'll kind of just have nice, like a nice little wave. So I'll figure it out. And I actually think I'm going to end the video here and we'll pick up on a part two to this. So you guys can see me in my dress and then how I 
style my hair stuff for tonight so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video and until the next one ciao i want to thank me for doing all this hard work